do I find it so hard but when I know in my heart Hey what's going on guys it's Noor bringing you another easy convert video this one's going to be about our slot template so the first thing you're going to need to do is go ahead and open up easy convert all right now that the software is open you're going to go ahead and head over to settings which is this icon here and then you're going to see slot template and you're going to go ahead and click it so now there's two ways to access this slot template you can either do it from the software within or from our easy convert discord um, you can just head over to our announcements channel and check the pinned messages and then you can find our template there. Um, there will be a picture on the screen to show um, what I'm exactly uh, trying to illustrate. So once you get to this page, all you need to do is click make a copy. But since I already made a copy before this video, I'm just going to head over to that new uh, form that I made earlier. So once again, the form you'll see um, its name is template, so you can change it to whatever. So let's say I'm doing Supreme Slots, okay? So I'll change it, change the name to Supreme Slots Week One. That's perfect. I can change it to whatever, forty-five dollars a slot. But yeah, as you guys can see, this is the example product image, so you can name it, or you can basically change the title, change the image as well, do whatever. So then you see the fields, item name, color, size, you know, and then the important stuff starts, okay? So these three you can put it in whatever order you want but here's what i'm suggesting for the user starting at email you want it to keep it in the same order all right because this will make life so much easier you keep it in the same order up until um billing uh same question mark okay i'll show you guys why it's important to keep it the same so once people have filled out slots you'll see you'll you'll have responses right so once you have the responses you're going to go ahead and click this create spreadsheet button okay little green thing you're going to click it and that's going to say create a new spreadsheet you can name it whatever i'm going to call it s1 all right and then i'm going to go ahead and hit create so once it's created it's going to open up so as you can see everything is already filled here and and you're probably wondering hey can i just download this as a csv and import it to um easy convert you cannot yet so what you will need to do is you'll need to go back to easy convert you'll need to go back to the template okay and you'll need to do file make a copy okay and then after you've made a copy you're gonna go ahead and copy from email okay this column right here email okay so I only had one slot filled out but you might have like 500 so you might be selecting like a large amount so I'm just gonna copy this one row over here and I'm gonna copy all the way up until true so I'm gonna control C control V you guys can do right click copy all right and then I'm gonna go back to the slot template and then I'm gonna delete all the profiles here that are just default okay you want to always want to delete these because these are just random profiles and you want to only put in yours so what you're gonna notice is that the only thing the slot template doesn't fill is the profile name so all you literally need to do is just copy from the email column all the way up until the billing same column and all you have to do here is once you go back to the, our profile template is click on the email tab okay or click on the email input box and then you're just going to do control v and as you can see the whole row will fill within order so that is why the slot template is so easy to use because there's just a few extra clicks but it saves so much time because if you do it in order then you only have to just literally select like you can select like a hundred rows just like going up and down you know okay like if this was like in the next row or whatever then you're gonna have to copy this and then you're gonna have to copy that one by one you know but you don't want that obviously because we already did it for you so that's why you want to keep the format the same so if the format's the same all you will literally need to do is control C control V and then you'll just need to add a profile name okay so I'm gonna name this the profile name whatever EF whatever all right so now you can just now this is like the same as profile conversion you can just hit file you can go to download as and then you can go download as a csv once you download as a csv okay you can go ahead and open it i'm going to import this to the desktop minimize that i'm going to go back to drag and drop so i'm going to drag and drop right here boom click the white arrow for next and let's say i want to import to project destroyer so i'm going to name this pd slot okay and then i'm going to save to my favorite location convert success and that is all you need to do all right so if you guys are a little confused slow down watch the video again all right 
There's a few extra steps, but this will make life a lot easier for everyone that's doing slots. And we'll have more updates in the future to make slaughters, slot people's lives much easier, alright? Thank you for watching the video. I'll see you guys later.